Hey there everyone, this is Danielle playing some Bioshock. Last time we finished the medical pavilion, uh, I wandered around for a while because I couldn't find the second little sister, but we found her. And now we're here in Neptune's Bounty, which has three little sisters to find, among other things. Now you had the pleasure of Andrew Ryan's company. He's the one who built this place, and he's the one who ran it into the ground. Nobody knows exactly what happened. Maybe he went mad. Maybe the power got to him. Maybe he just decided he didn't like people. Whichever way you slice it, good man died. My family's in a submarine hidden in the foundation of Fontaine Fisheries. I'll meet you there. This is the gene bank. Uh, we only have two slots in every one at the moment, but if we find a gatherer's garden, we might be able to change things around. Here's another cyclus of values. I think we're good at the moment. Thank you, Circus of Values. Something red down there. Okay, that's the thing that a little sister carries. There's probably one nearby somewhere. Here we go. Oh, spooky shadow. Yeah, this game can be kind of spooky. <laughs> oh, incidentally, you probably didn't notice, but this thing is where the little sisters go when they've been rescued. They crawl up into that hole there. That's how they leave the level safely. Uh, there's a bunch of them scattered around. There's a little sister right there. We're gonna want to rescue her. You may not be well equipped to do so just yet. <laughs> There's Fontaine Fisheries, which is where we're trying to go. But uh, we also want to save this little sister if we can manage it. Oh, we hit with something explosive. Oh, there's one of those nitro splices. <sighs> okay, we're back here at the Vita chamber, fighter chamber, the chamber. to get back there and the big daddy stays damaged uh, because it's a it's a respawn it's not an actual like loading for a checkpoint so we should be better equipped to take him down now oh uh, they're also fighting with those guys we can let a little infighting happen first and that might whittle down the health a little bit close. I'm not super good at this game, I just really enjoy it in terms of flavour and everything, so 
Um, yeah. Uh, I might try the machine gun next. Got some rounds for it. Okay. One little sister rescued. There we go. You have shown kindness to my little one. Thank you. But are you really a friend to us? Regardless, a little one brings you a gift to demonstrate our appreciation. An Embam wants to reward you. The reward will be inside a teddy bear at a gatherer's garden. So next time we find a gatherer's garden, there'll be a nice prize. And yeah, you can see they crawl through there, and that's how they escape from the level without getting killed by everything. Probably helps that they're also super resilient, as that diary from last video talked about. interesting. So, the bathospheres are locked to people who are genetically similar to Andrew Ryan. Uh, that makes our first aid kits better. We will equip that for now. Slightly more health. There's a rocket turret over there. Disney one that curves this way, and that's a completed hack. Okay, so the rocket turret is now on my side. Could make this a bit easier.
under there, or does it not let me? Yep, I can. Anything else down here? Great. Some pistol rounds in it. Yes, that's cool. Keypad I don't know the code for. I'll have a look around and see if I can find it. Gatherer's garden, and there's the prize. See what we got. 200 Adam, hypnotize Big Daddy, and smile and piercing pistol rounds. My first reward from Tenenbaum for saving little sisters. New plasmid. Need a bodyguard and a pinch? Our new hypnotize plasma will fool the Big Daddy into pretending he was for its own little sister. Uh, I'll keep that in the gene rank for the moment. The problem with that is you usually want to take out the Big Daddy, um, which you can't do if they're protecting you. Uh, Asmid slot. Yes, slots are good. You can see they're quite expensive, though. Hmm. New plasmid slot unlocked. Click the plasmid. Light up foes to a thousand degrees. Warning, fire spreads. I think we've already seen this one. Okay, um, we can't afford another plasmid slot. We might want to go for health upgrades though. Okay, probably enough for now. So yeah, we have three slots now, so we have Telekinesis, and Incinerate, and Electrobolt. And we'll be getting more Adam and getting more options as we go. Uh, uh. Uh, some more first aid kits would be good. And potato chips, yum yum yum, there we go. Excuse me, turret. I need to get past you. There we go. Ammunition. We don't want alcohol or cigarettes because both of those damage your stats when you use them. Like, it recovers. I think cigarettes recover Eve, but not health, and whiskey recovers health, but reduces Eve, or something like that. We don't want either of those things. We want both of our stats to go up. Atlas Radio gone ahead. Says you were here looking for an invite to the fisheries. Nuts, I say. But if in your head's up to the Wharfmaster's office and find old Peach a research camera, maybe I could manage an invite. Yeah, we want a research camera. Well, what was that? My friend, you are fucked. I sure am. This blaster has a lot of health. Okay, we got the grenade launcher. 
lots of Fontaine on you, and I'll have you in a box. Atlas gives you the vouch, but I ain't turning my eye just on his say-so. Oh, they do, but I gotta hack for them. Mm, never mind. Yeah, some vending machine items you've got to use for hacking, otherwise you can't have them. I think I do want to hack the Pipers. Hang on. Start hack. Yeah, of course you can hack the vending machines. <laughs> uh, this way, and then this way. Sort of away. There we go, there we go, and then we need. There we go, job done. Active ending machine. Now if we open it up, everything's a bit cheaper and we can get to the hack, hack only items like the e-pipos, what we're looking for. Uh, I'm gonna get some chips while we're here. Yeah, there we go. Plenty of e-pipos. Be well equipped for our next phase. <laughs> Yeah, that sounds fair. Okay, that didn't go super well. Go for a bit of a crawl. There's another diary. Something must be done about Fontaine. While I was buying buildings and fish futures, he was cornering the market on genotypes and nucleotide sequences. Rapture. It's transforming before my eyes. The great chain is pulling away from me. Perhaps it's time to give it a talk. Pipos, more first aid kits, good stuff. Oops. <laughs> uh, through here. Oh, hello, what we got here? Proximity mines. Just around and some honey. There's a big daddy, so there's probably, yeah, there's a little sister. 
we let them fight with each other. Sea slug is quite important. Okay, let's take on the big daddy, I guess. Hear my keyboard. <laughs> oh, dang it. When was the last Vita chamber? Vita chamber? Chamber. You know the one. This thing. Damn, all the way back here. Huh. Oh. Big Daddy? Not sure. Be a different one. fix it. I'm hacking a lot more than I did the first time I played this. I think I think because I was on easy I didn't need to do it as much. But yeah, it's kind of important. Uh this way, then this way. And then this way and that way, then five ways peak like that. There we go. Friendly turret. It's okay. It's all okay. No, no. Okay, we're gonna help her here. Help here. There you go. There you go. And you're safe. Thank you, Mister. You're welcome. Thank you.
So yeah, um, they were kidnapping these children and converting them into little sisters to, in order to fuel the city's need for Adam. Previous stars, I don't know. For sure. So I want to go to both of those places, and I've only got one one of the codes now. I can't hack that, so I guess I'll just shoot it until it breaks. There we go, too high up. Okay, I do want to find out what's happening under Fontaine Fisheries. This Fontaine fellow is somebody to watch. Once he was just a menace to be convicted and hung. But he always manages to be where the evidence isn't. He's the most dangerous type of hoodlum. The kind with vision. And not hung. I assume Andrew Ryan said that because he doesn't consider other people to be people. But yeah, yeah, the word is hanged. Uh, I remember where was it? It's down here somewhere. I think it's down here? Yes. Yeah, it's this. 
Yeah, the hacking minigame in Bioshock 2 is much, much faster. So it would be nice to be able to use that one, but we can't do that until we get to Bioshock 2, unfortunately. So that's going to be a while, because this game isn't exactly short. Uh, that, that. That. That'll work. Okay. The research camera looks just like one you'd see topside. According to this magazine article I scrounged up, it can also analyze genetic information, past biological structures, Okay, so we're going to leave it here for now. Next time we'll get the research camera. And maybe we'll get to go to that other place we need a code for. I need to check the video footage from what the code is. Because, <laughs> yeah, it doesn't look like you can backtrack and play previous recordings. Unless it's this one? No? Hang on. Oh, you can. You can. You can go back to everything. Marsha, come home. There, 7533. Cool. Okay, okay, cool. I, I hadn't really thought about that so much, but yeah, we can go back to that, and we'll do that next time. Hacking, minigame. Okay, that route's obviously not going to work. I need to do more of a there, that'll work. Ah! Ah! Okay. <laughs> Yeah, um, Ryan sends these little security robots. Pack this one as well. And this one. <laughs> There's lots of hacking going on. system is now mostly on my side. Oh, this one. <laughs> oh, that's annoying. Not too far back is all is Lara, so not a huge deal. 
I've already hacked most of the stuff on the way. Another rocket turret in that corner. <laughs> Extending the video time by hacking everything inside. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, that goes there, that goes there. is on my side. Hmm? Okay, still got shot by something explosive. Possible the rocket was trying to shoot the guy behind me is the thing though. Oh, too many A-pipos. Okay, um, yeah, I'm going to call it for this video, like I was saying I was going to, but now it's actually happening. Okay. <laughs> so thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed. Um, next time, uh, we'll probably finish Neptune's Bounty, we've done most of it at this point. Uh, we do have to get the camera and then bring the camera back, so we're not quite that, we're not super close to the end yet, but we're getting there. So thank you for watching. Bye. <laughs>